Hey everyone, Scott Rice Games here, and welcome back to Resident Evil Revelations. That was a bit shit. My microphone, my brand new microphone, is currently stuck onto my mic arm with blue tack. I broke the screw mount. Do you know how I broke it? Turning it. Turning it. Doing something completely normal, and I broke it. I despair. This year, I've broken so much shit, and I'm just like... <laughs> Why? I wasn't even being rough with it. I, I didn't even do anything wrong. I, uh, uh. I've had this for a month. Th 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 this Tascam, I've had it for a month. Anyway, we're on to episode four now. Episode five, I think. We're episode four of the Let's Play, but I think we're on to episode five. Previously on Resident Evil Revelations. Ooh, Chris. Hey. That's you, isn't it? Still hurting, Cadet? No, I can still fight. That's the spirit. Uh, I guess you thought of everything. But even the FBC may not be able to cover its tracks on this one. Let the heavens scorch the earth with justice. Racking the city all over again. Enteric visions. No more. Looks like we both were too late. Both of you. Look. Abandon hope, all ye who enter here. Abandoned hope. He's quoting Dante. I'll find you, Jill. I promise. Anyway. So that's everything that happened before. I still don't know whether I like the recaps, because when I do Let's Plays, I like doing the recaps. I like giving really shit previously on this Let's Play things. Anyway. Episode 4, A Nightmare Revisited. We killed these bastards already. It looks like you missed a few. And they're on this ship. And now they want to use the virus to stage another attack. They seek the truth about Terra Grigia and vengeance. Alrighty. Jim, look at this. Oh god, my sensitivity is way up. Alright. The ship's running on emergency power. But the comm system needs the shotgun. main power. We need to bring the engine room back online. That won't be easy. Okay, we've got full ammo for that. Because this vessel was involved in a prior accident, the safety standards that go beyond those outlined in the Maritime Safety Act have been introduced. All crew must read and study this manual to be prepared in to be prepared to act in case of an emergency. The Queen Zenobia has two unique power generators. So this is important because we need to get power back on. If the main power generator should fail, the backup generator in the in the bilge in the bilge? In the binge? In the bilge will compensate for its loss and supply the entire ship with operating power. <coughs> I think I'm getting sick. This ship contains vertical and horizontal bulkheads that automatically divert water in case of flooding. In the event of emergency, the bulkheads can be operated by the control system in the bilge. The bilge. The system will continue to operate even after sustaining minimal damage. Right. Now, I was talking, so I wasn't paying a single bit of attention as to what we have to do. Ooh, grenade. Single bit of attention as to what we have to do. So, yeah. I don't like that our friend has already run off. That makes me concerned. Ooh. The sky is loading screen. That's why it freaked out when I moved. Raymond. Oh, another. Take it. Oh, there he is. You might need it. Like you said, turning on the power won't be easy. Thanks, buddy. Anchor key. Nice. Okay. The casino on the first floor. Then you'll find a lift to take you to the bill. But tell me something first. You didn't see any other FBC members here, did you? I can't reach my partner, Rachel. Damn it. I haven't heard from her since she went to the village. Rachel is dead. Sorry, boy. Rachel's ever dead or some kind of boss. Okay. Oh, God. So difficult for me because when I um when I, when I when I usually play 
fuck's sake, Jill Valentine. Yeah, when I play a Resident Evil game, I usually kind of binge it. Wait, this will be the anchor key, right? Yes! I thought so. Yeah, I usually binge a Resident Evil game. So, I have a lot more time to remember it, where keys and things are and such things. Although, although this is more classic, it's definitely a lot easier. It's a DS game, isn't it? So, hence all the little funnynessness, 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 funny, bizarre qualities the game possesses. Uh, oh no! Power's out. Why can't I just climb up there and get it? Ugh. That'd be far too simple, wouldn't it? But yeah, as I was about to say, hopefully everything in all of the games that I play should be running a lot smoother. Because I was getting a lot of overheating problems with my PC. Because a stock fan was just not cutting it. Everything was like at 80 degrees and everything was running really slowly and I was having rendering issues and all sorts with um like video exporting was starting to take like six hours but before it took like 45 minutes um 45 minutes for my let's plays that is so i've got a i don't know the name of it um it's corsair k65 i think it's like a compound cooler it's an old one but oh boy has it helped a lot it's like a little liquid cooling Compound thing. It was the same thing which I managed to break my pro break my processor while installing, because I took the processor out because I'm an idiot and I was worried about getting thermal paste on everything because I never put thermal paste on anything and I broke my um, six core processor. So yeah, that's great. I finally found out how to bypass the security on the VIP room. That room's reserved for all the high rollers, so I've always been curious about what goes on in there. It's so easy. All you have to do is feed coins to the casino girl next door, and you can bypass any security. You can bypass any security, and then what? You have to hit the precise weight, 107 grams, a small price to pay for access to the VIP room. 107 grams. Nice! Sweet, so now I can carry even more ammo. Well, that's good. I thought that was a legit person up there. I thought, hey, is that Rachel? No, that's not Rachel. Please use coins. Okay, so that's obvious what I have to do. I have to get the power on. I have to get that coin out of there and put the coin on the thing. Easy peasy. Now what's going to jump out and kill me? Not so easy peasy. Okay, be right back. Going to... Try and find out where the bilge is. And I've got a bunch of places to open up again now. Um, deck? The bilge would be on the deck, right? Okay, ammo boxes. Not a good sign. <laughs> Sorry, that was a worst laugh ever. Card reader. Right. keep reminding myself G for grenade that was a waste of time apart from knowing that there's somewhere with rifle ammo that was a complete waste of time oh the cabins yeah yeah yeah, yeah. there's one locked door a book note found in room 303 the hell is going on monsters crawling over the ship they're tearing it to pieces I've never seen monsters like this their movements are stiff stilted but it's all over if they get a hold of you those piece of shit monsters ain't my friend Hassan. Bastards. I used my gun to frighten them off, giving me time to get the hell out of there. The bullet went straight through its arm. Thank god those monsters have bones like an old woman. There's nowhere left to run now. Damn monster twisted my leg good. Hell, I've run out of ammo too. God only knows how I'm going to survive this. Okay, so shotgun nearby? Hey! Okay. So now we do have the shotgun, at least. <laughs> Fuck that! 
I'm out. I'm not wasting my, my shotgun ammo on that guy. Fucking Resident Evil's cheap jump scares. Ah. Uh. Okay, Windhelm. Nice. There's still that. There's still that, which is... Uh, once we find the card reader, we need to remember about that. Okay, now... How the hell do I get back? Oh! Well, I'm, I'm, I'm so smart. I just went all around looking for the power, and it was right there. I don't trust those fish. I really don't. It's a luxury ship. They have things like casino. Yes. Holy shit. Shit, it's been infected. Watch out. I saw these in a video. A gift from our friend in the gas mask. I should thank you. Die, you- Oh my god. No, die, you abomination freak of- Oh! Fuck, it's behind me! No, no, no! Fuck the ocean! Fuck the ocean! Die! Oh! No. Oh, kill it! Kill it! Kill the ocean! Finally quieted down a little. Great. Don't tell me. So, I can get more coins with this? I wish I had one of these at Be home. Don't tell me we have to fucking... We have to... Ugh. So, what does that one... No, that one doesn't work. How many of these slot machines... Please tell me that's enough. Bundle of coins. Right. Okay, I'm glad we didn't have to do that for that long. I used to lose so much money in Pokemon Fire Raid slot machines. It was actually quite sad. This is why I don't gamble to this day. Oh no, it was... It wasn't 100 grams. It was... How many grams was it? 107 grams. Yes, there we go. Boom. Open the door. Maps. Anyone in here? No. No one in here. Well, that's bloody good. Okay. What's this note here? A scribbled memo. Dearest friend, I'm at my wit's end. I am sorry, but I must go on ahead. They are sleeping, but they will wake up eventually. Now's my chance. Just thinking about them makes my hair stand on end. Their ugly bodies are not of this world. Their stench, their rotting organs, and their screams like echoes from hell itself. I am so frightened that I can't stop shaking, even now as I write this. Be careful, the bloated blisters on the walls are their eggs. You can regenerate- they can regenerate from them. Please, don't think that I've abandoned you. I did it for my family. I will pray for your safety. Ah, uh, so if we shoot the blisters, maybe they won't regenerate anymore. Is a pasta- Oh. For anyone who has seen the latest Resident Evil film, I don't feel comfortable about this. I don't... I don't want to... You scare me! You scare me! Here's the lid. Yeah, I feel like we're going to go crashing to us. Yeah, I thought as much. It. Okay. I'll check around here, see if it turns up. Roger that. I'll look for it on my end. Are we splitting up? Why are we splitting up? Why the hell would we do that?
Okay, right. Yeah. Find anything yet? I'm at a loss here. So you're just gonna stand there on Okay. So I need to go back. Back through the tunnel. Those are going to burst at some point. One of these again. There we go. All nodes are connected. I'm getting better at these. Ding! Great. Looks like we got another boss battle coming up, friend. Friend! My friends! Super duper. It's just, it's just cringe. Then again, where, when aren't I cringe? Oh, well. Oh, this is where we started off, right at the beginning of the game. Things got worse, to say the least. Was there anything I missed here in these cabinets? There was. Herb. Well, that's great. I'm down to four bullets on my pistol already. Never mind. <laughs> oh, wow. One shot, click, click, boom, where dead. Found that dummy of Chris. Where is the real Chris? Parts. That's a good question. And I'm going to get my shotgun out because I bet I know what's waiting behind this door. Oh, a pipe. Oh, that the strangest form of BOW ever. Rachel became a pipe. Now we have a decision here. Um. Do I swap out the shotgun? I just drop all of that and then I pick up the MP5 and then I don't have to swap the weapon. Okay, ooh. So let's check out what this is like. So, it's got a good firing speed. Um, yeah, I think. Because we're in quite close quarters. Shotgun, pistol, machine gun. Because we're, we're not going to be using uh, a sniper rifle. Someone's just cummed everywhere. Haha, <laughs> mature joke. Okay, it was around here. Diary. No cl clues as to who left this note. It was Rachel. Let's be real. I was forced on this mission. I had no desire to come here for a job that could get me killed. At any rate, stage one is complete. I got the key for the fright lift. Now I can access. I got the key for the fright lift. Now I can access the bilge. The ship was used as a base of operations for the terrorist attack on Terra Grigia one year ago. I found the UAVs in the ship four deck that was used to dispense a virus. So like, oh okay. Finding the UAV was good. Getting attacked out of nowhere by an ugly monster was bad. Well, you'd think so, wouldn't you? I knew this mission would suck from the moment I took it. 
My head feels like it's going to split open. I lost an eye already. It's hard to see. I feel like crap. Arms are starting to feel weird too. I love this. Um, I love this so much because in the first Resident Evil game, there was a diary from a zombie. So you could actually see the symptoms and signs and the process of becoming what they became. And I, I just I just think it's so cool and it's cool to see it again. Arms are starting to feel weird too. My rot, my rot arm, my right arm split in two. Blood all over my body. You can see my bones. Need doctor bad. Writing obscured by blood. Yeah. Hey! the target and she's a zombie isn't that always the case <laughs> uh. what the actual fuck Fuck me! Fuck me! Run away! Run away! Run away! Fuck! Uh... Why don't you want to come in here, Rachel? Why are you so scared of this room? Are you? Rachel, are, are you okay? Where the fuck are you? Fuck me! She's reminding me of Lisa. Tell you what, it really does uh, just rack your entire body when she finds you. Move, move, move. So quickly. This virus is more powerful than I thought. Just like the other guy. Okay. My arm. That's a very good comedy Christ. Why have I just done that?
How do I have no ammo left? What the actual fuck? I'm gonna need to reload to last checkpoint because I, I can't. I don't have any ammo. I keep having this fucking problem with boss fight. Hopefully once I go through to here. So maybe that'll help. Come on, bitch. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Ooh. Alright, yes, we did it, we did it. Ah, I love this fucking rifle. Lift key, so right. Okay, we must be getting near to the end now. No, she did not die by the sounds of that. Which is lovely to think Does about. Absolutely lovely. Let's do this and hopefully not crush to our deaths. Resident Evil loves its big lifts. I hear something. Straight into the depths of hell. Right. As I thought, sounds like the end of the episode, so I hope you guys enjoyed that. Thank you for watching, as always. Give a like if you enjoyed it, and subscribe to see more of Resident Evil Revelations. S rank. Nice. Zero deaths. Zero deaths. Clear time an hour. Oh, that didn't take as long as I thought. Um, hopefully I can halve this video down to at least 30 minutes is what I'm hoping for. That's what I'm hoping for. Right. I'm going to head out now. See you guys. Bye.